I grabbed this wooden square from Dollar Tree, gave it a good sanding because it was a little rough around the edges. And then just applied some brown acrylic paint and used a baby wipe to apply the paint on. And this is just going to leave you with a faux wood stained finish without using any of those harsh chemicals that are inside a wood stain. Then I got this wooden round off of Amazon. However, you could use an embroidery hoop. And I am using Dollar Tree adhesive glue with a mixture of hot glue to glue that right in the center of that wooden square. And just allow those glues to completely adhere for about 10 to 15 minutes. Then I just grabbed some fake greenery off of Amazon as well. I am using some white chalk paint just to kind of dust some of that paint on to make it look like the picks are snowed on. However, if you don't want to use paint, you could always use just some fake snow in a can. I didn't have any, so I'm going to use the chalk paint. And then just allow that to dry and then go ahead and grab the wooden square with the embroidery hoop and just start placing the greenery right down and i just used a mixture of hot glue and my staple gun to hold all of these pieces down however if you just have hot glue you could just use that i just use my staple gun just for some extra support and this part is completely up to you however you want to create it I got these little picks off of Amazon, so I just added those down, and then I added another pick that I got from Hobby Lobby in the center, so that way it covers up the ends of the original picks that I put down. And honestly, you could leave the project just like this, and it looks absolutely stunning, but I added a few embellishments. So I got this reindeer ornament, also came from Hobby Lobby. Just found a good placement for, for it in between the picks and just put a generous amount of hot glue on the deer's feet and just held that down until she was completely adhered. And then just grabbed some red ornaments from Dollar Tree, just tied them on a piece of string Tied them on the top of that embroidery hoop and then just hot glued the string in place so that way they're not moving around on me. And I did just have one bigger than the other and then I also have one hanging a little bit lower than the other. And I think this just came out so adorable. Great addition to your home decor. I hope this inspires you guys to create your own in your own special way. If it did, please be sure to sprinkle the love. Thank you so much, and I hope you all have a good rest of your day. Thanks. Bye.